another day, another nail appointment. My nails are literally <laughs> suffering, so I need to get them in order. I'm a nail addict. I have like a headache. Literally, I have like a headache that's brewing. <coughs> Just so tired, but anyways, well, let's get these nails in order. I think I'll see you guys at the end when I show you what they look like. Turns out I ain't for you. We made them plans and I let them fall through. Didn't mean to cause all this. guys finally done with the nails it's pretty late it's giving it's giving that ten past six but here are my nails super super cute why did I start the vlog with the end of a nail session <laughs> I don't know why I did that but I'm heading over home I just quickly uploaded the vlog that I'm going to post tomorrow on my YouTube so that I could get the checks like the music checks, the copyright checks, and the Wi-Fi at Nail Addict is pretty good. The Wi-Fi at my house, the Wi-Fi at Taiwan is giving struggle though. So now I'm gonna go ahead and head home. Yo, I need to see my friend. She's flying back to Europe tomorrow. So I need to see her before she leaves. So that's the plan. I'm gonna go drive by her house. See how quickly. I wish we could have done a Chibaga date. Guys, the way I'm so obsessed with corn. Like roasted corn, it's actually so crazy. Anyways, look at how beautiful Highland Park looks at night. With my face in it, of course, I make it pretty out, don't I? Anyways, <laughs> I'm almost at my car, guys. I'm almost at my car. There is, there she is. Let me quickly show you. So yeah, there she is, the little red one. I miss Zoe. For some reason, I left her when I left home. She was sleeping, so I actually kind of miss her. I can't wait to see her. Though she throws the weirdest tantrum. Just like giving three nature, like girl. My car is so dirty. If my car could scream that I wash it. No, well, it's clean outside. It's dirty inside. You know, the dirt in your... There's Zoe's clocks. There's everything. Anyways, guys, let me drive home. I hope you guys do enjoy this vlog. My car's not starting. It's doing that thing with the steering wheel's jagged. Yo, Sana. Eh, the car is not. Okay. This is giving scary, honestly. Alright. Mm, not a good place to start. Let me try start this car, guys. Okay, this is low-key scaring me, actually. I'm doing everything you're supposed to do, like play with the steering wheel. It's still not like... Oh, there we go. Whew. Let me go home. I'll catch you guys. Bye. I honestly don't understand why my air conditioner in my car would actually just stop working. But here with the heat, I'm about to go to school run. It's 11... Excuse me. 11.55. So Zoe knocks off at 12.30. I just wanted to do a quick car unboxing so it's already opened but yeah I just wanted to show you guys this this is my first Aldo bag like a handbag of course I have the other Aldo a suitcase but this is my first Aldo handbag and I really really like how it looks it's giving like you can rock it to dinner and you can also rock it to like a late lunch or a brunch I don't think there's a bag I don't know if I'll carry this bag throughout the day just because of the gold chain but you never know you might see me carrying it throughout the whole day but this is what the bag looks like and then you just open it you press here and then it has like uh one zipper pocket inside and then the little spaces on the why oh my god and then the little spaces here and then obviously the main like compartment so i think it can carry quite a number of stuff so i just wanted to show you guys that before we go to school right? it's so hot it's literally so I wonder how many degrees it is right now, but it's just so hot. I wonder if getting this install in the summer was such a good idea because of you. And also my air conditioner stopped working. I don't know. That's the thing, my air conditioner. Like it works. You see, my car is doing that thing again. Like where it just won't start. Anyways, arrived at food lovers. Come finza. 
No, is it country? No, not food. What am I saying? Food lover is Greendale. Guys, the way this place has changed. The way this place has changed. I just need to do some bit of groceries. Guys, literally my hairline has left the chat. <laughs> but I don't know how else I can fix it. But yep. I just need some a bit of groceries. So I'll take I'll take you guys inside. I'm with Zoe and her dad. They're walking behind me there. Holding hands, being lovers. Honestly, they don't care for me when they're together. I'm, I'm, I'm the one who's like third wedding. Can you guys say hi? Can you guys be seen? No, I don't think so. But. <laughs> shopping in food lovers yeah it was packed i think that's why i really struggled with vlogging i'm gonna take this skinny cold press shot yeah we're gonna try it out did you take a shot did you end up taking a shot a skinny shot but you're the one who sold them 
Uh, okay, how to? Okay, let me open it. Then we'll take it together. There goes nothing. Ah, the ginger is. Sorry, the turmeric is prominent. Yo, yeah, do you want to taste? It's giving health. But I'm actually warming up to it. We just got back from Food Lovers. I think I'm going to go ahead and pack my fridge and see what we got. Plans that I ain't for you. We made them plans and I let them fall through. Didn't mean to cause all this Road. I'm at Sam's place. I need to collect some lash tape. I don't want to wait for that car honestly to pass first, but I need some lash tape and then I'm gonna go to FBC. I try to do this as early as possible. 9.44 record time when I'm not going to work, but yeah, I need lash tape and then I'm gonna go to FBC uh, deposit some money uh, because Eco Cash Mastercard has just decided not to work. Why is my thimble acting like this? Why are you okay? Yes. Yeah. And then from there, I'm gonna go to yo. I'm gonna go to Card ZW to get my memory card. If you guys remember the situation, but yeah. So I came to Sam's place for this little thing. I'm out of um, lash tape. And like today, I was supposed to have a client for lashes, but she postponed honestly in good time because she takes me like two hours before that she's like, Ish, the work is giving something else. So I rescheduled her appointment, but then I just decided to get the lash tape. Now, do I go to FBC first or do I go to. Uh, do I go to FB first, FBC first or do I go to. Um, what's it called? I want to go to. Let me go to the, the furniture place at Crochet Interiors. Let me go. Yeah, I have, I have a love-hate relationship with Crochet Interiors. But honestly, I keep going back because <laughs> their furniture is so good. So to be honest, I'd rather have the headache and have like nice furniture. So that's why I honestly keep going back because... Anyways, let me go to Crochet Interiors and pay because honestly this closet situation that we have is actually not cute like my my clothes are in changani bags like since that time like even the dresser was not enough like the dresser just fit my husband's clothes 
honestly like we can't keep leave, living like this like where my husband doesn't have a closet well at least i, I don't know i can't well because <laughs> most of my husband's clothes stay at his like at his job so he only has like a few clothes at home you know because he's only at home two days a week and two days out of the week and then he is back at work like for five so um yeah that's why he he doesn't need a huge closet so i was able to pack ooh, ooh, i was able to pack everything of his in the in the dresser and then but now um i kind of feel like still um, i need to put i would rather put my clothes in the dresser and put his clothes in the closet i i feel like it just makes more sense to me anyways let me drive safely guys i actually think i'm getting lost but let me drive safely and then i'll catch you at crochet interiors another stop at crochet interiors is there anybody in oh that looks gorgeous knock knock hello hello Morning. Morning. I'm at your shop. It's open, but there's nobody. We're by the gate. We're about to enter. Okay. Cool. I'm standing outside. Guys, I know my hair looks crazy, but um, I just want to quickly unbox these things for Instagram. Like, I know this is wigs. I quickly want to unbox them for Instagram, and then we'll un no, 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 and then we'll unbox them together. Ah, uh ah! -uh, don't beat me. We're now at that stage, guys. Anyways, let me unbox them, and then I'll come back to 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 YouTube, and then we'll finish off the unboxing. Hey guys so i finished my unboxing for instagram so what i did with those wigs um the sheen was running a buy one get one uh free on uh, what's it called on last week i think the last week or two and then a friend she was just like mrs m please buy one get one free uh, tell your consumers so what i did was i looked for someone to share with because i didn't want to miss this special and guys when i tell you i am not disappointed so this wig um if i'm to get my phone uh, we bought those, these, 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 these. We bought these wigs uh, for um, the actual price was. I'm just opening it up in my app. Okay, the actual price for the wig was eighty nine ninety four, which is ninety dollars. So we shared the ninety dollars. So it was forty five a piece, and then we're also going to share the customs. So I think. Uh, if I'm to find out how much customs I bought, I I paid. I think at most it was like. Ten dollars at most so we're gonna share that so in total it comes up to about fifty dollars a piece for a 20 inch wig pre plucked pre bleached my I was shocked I was like pre bleached I said she and is in their bag this is pre bleached pre plucked and then it comes with them um it comes with the adjustable band and then it comes with the wig cap and then the user guide and then it comes with um, 
wait where's the box so basically this is what the yeah the box that dismantled guys because obviously with shipping and everything like they'll obviously get dismantled so if your hair is human hair it comes in these like little pink boxes and i'm super super happy like it's the pre it's the pre-bleached and pre-plucked for me that shocked me i really wish i could put this wig on but obviously and the knots are so thin they are so fine and it was 180 percent density i think the sale is now over but i was posting about it on my status and like not a lot of people were interested so i got this lady to share with me i almost missed the sale because what was i gonna do with two weeks maybe if i tried selling them for like 50 bucks people would then think it's um, i'm duping them just to get my my half back but anyways that's what the wig looks like i'm gonna i'm gonna install it sometime soon probably when i remove this hairstyle and then i'll install it um i don't know why i didn't get the free gifts maybe i was supposed to put like a coupon code uh to get the free gift i think i was supposed to put like i think i was supposed to put like wigs for you or something like that anyways um let me go guys i'm really really happy with this wig like surprise surprise pleasantly surprised if i'm being honest this is the one that's gonna be mine because i've opened it so let me quickly edit my reel and post it i had to comb my hair real quick let me quickly edit my reel i was just telling the lady that i shared with that our wigs are amazing uh she's asking me how much do, do you charge for install anyways guys let me go yeah let me go it was nice oh wait no i didn't unbox everything this is a client this big one is a client and i know which client it is and i'm not gonna open that one but i had some things that were stuck in my shingle for a while so like these shorts i bought i have the gray one so i wanted the black ones i bought these like maybe over maybe over six maybe even over a year ago so the way in my shingle and i kept forgetting every time to pick them up because i have the gray ones i wanted the black ones and then this was something that was in my shingle at the collection point that was never collected uh the client never collected the client never communicated so I guess they'll just, um, you know, they've just come back. So it's basically like a top. It's a top and then there's some jewelry. And also, guys, I might be closing the Shein business now. Like, it doesn't make financial sense anymore. So it might just be coming to a close because since I moved to Harare, it's now more expensive for me to get things in Harare because the address that I use, it doesn't have, like, to get a Harare bus is very, very difficult. So this might be the end of the journey. But when it comes to, like, my personal stuff, obviously, I'll keep buying those. But in terms of business, unless maybe I'm just serving Harare clients, but also, like, there's a lot of, like, people doing Shein now and people have found better and more cheaper ways to serve clients which i haven't figured out that one so i guess um that's what people are using but if people still want to use me then it's fine but then it's not like i won't be like going through massive advertising like i used to. i feel like i need to put it down for a bit re-strategize and then take it back up because honestly at some point it was feeding our family and i was very happy about it anyways guys let me go offline um let me go offline let me go edit my reel tie back my hair because i'm done and then i'll just continue watching the vlog that i was watching anyway see you guys soon guys so i'm just gonna quickly get started on dinner i washed these potatoes yesterday i want to make a stew with carrot and potato uh we had some <clears throat> leftover like peppers that were really cut so the only thing that i need to cut is onion and then for the side what am i i was thinking of doing a uh, actually we've been eating coleslaw like <laughs> we've been eating coleslaw in this house like it's the end of the world like do i want to eat that again i don't think so but i want to make an early dinner because zoe's not feeling too well so i'd just rather like get it over and done with do i have a pila in this house i thought so yeah i just want to get the dinner over and done with quickly uh before she wakes up because my helper has had a lot of laundry she had a lot of laundry to do because it's monday we're moving the bed sheets and 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 so it was just like a lot so yeah uh i already washed my hands before i decided to pick up the camera my battery is on 10 percent but let's see how much footage we can get before like the battery like her runs out anyways let's get cooking Look 
into your eyes, I see it. You're all I need. Every time I get a bit inside, I feel it. <laughs> Um, Zoe's not feeling well, so I ended up not being able to film the cooking. But here is the food that I made, guys. The best, eh, the best, the best thing about having a fridge now is we can now eat koslo, <laughs> koslo. <laughs> so I just made this stew. It looks really yummy. So hey guys, I'm preparing myself for bed. I need to go and quickly do my skincare routine and put on my pajamas and all the jazz. Tonight, I'm wearing um, this cute pyjama set from Shein. So it just comes with this shirt. I think I've worn it on the channel before. And it also comes with um, these pants. Like these pyjamas were like, I think five bucks. So th that's what I'm gonna wear. So typically what I do whenever I'm preparing for bed is actually fix up my hair. Today I wanna try these wash pads that I got in, in SA. I, I don't, no, I got them in Dubai at Miniso. So I'm gonna try them. I haven't actually use them ever since i bought them so we'll just do a nice little 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 we'll just do a nice little a high ponytail just to make sure that the hair is out of our way whilst we sleep yo guys i've been getting tempted to get braids but every time i look at them i'm like eh, nah i'll get bored in like a week so i guess this is the hairstyle that we're gonna have for a while. I'm thinking of relaxing my edges. I, yeah, let's quickly get changed and then we'll go ahead and do our skincare routine. So, whilst we're at it, I'm actually looking for um, ideas to decorate my, um, what's it called, to decorate my dresser because I finally managed to clear everything that was on it. I'm only left with cleaning the sofa, guys. I've literally had to pick myself up and tell myself that. I need to get things done and I can actually get them done. So yeah, I, I cleared the dresser finally. What I'm thinking is getting like a tray. Okay, let me show you. Okay, right now it's not clear. I put some things on there. Like there's my perfume and like my phone cases because I want to change out my phone case. But basically, I need I need to decorate like this whole area. So I'm gonna, I was just combing my hair. There's that box. But basically, I need to decorate this whole area. I'm thinking of putting like the glass thing uh for my perfumes because all of my perfumes have been staying in the bathroom except like this one that i bought and i just kept it in here this is the coach it's literally my favorite perfume i wear it every day i wanted to change out my phone case this is why this is here but anyways basically i need to decorate i need to decorate like this space and just come up with ideas so obviously i have the sh um obviously i have the sh uh the seashells that i got in cape town so i want to make like a like stick them maybe like if i buy a glass tray and then just stick them around and then put all my perfumes inside okay the light is doing something crazy yeah and then like put them all inside and then um okay, let me just record from here i think the lighting is better from here yeah so i want to do the tray and then put it in and then put the shelves and then just cover that up and then i don't know what i'm gonna do that side 
Uh, and then I want to get a plant. The problem is I can't afford the plant now. That's why the that's why we don't have the plant. But I found the perfect plant. Uh, the shop is actually very close to my house. So once I have the money for it, um, we're gonna put the plant. And then remember the closet that I paid for. So the closet that I paid for is gonna be like an attachment. Can you perfect? So the closet that I paid for is literally an attachment for this space where I'm still able to open the door. So I think the door will open about that much. But I told them to just put it like up to here. So that at least the door has like a room it can open like this much and then you have the walking space there and then literally i have the closet that has like a sliding door so yeah that's basically what what we're gonna do i hope that gives you like kind of like an idea and i wanted it that way because if we ever move from this place so i told her wait before i leave i told her not to put a wall like on the extra closet right so it's gonna have a sliding wall i told her not to put a back like don't put it back we're just gonna slide it in and then she measured this part uh i don't know if my 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 camera will tell she manages this part so that like even against the wall it has grid so if we ever move away from this house i'll be able to take it and then probably we can wall it in the future so yeah that's basically what we're doing hi zoe feeling any better okay yeah, the sickness is not happening today. Anyways guys, these are the little like facial like cleansing items that I was telling you about that I bought whilst we were out in Dubai. So this one is for removing your makeup, this one is for cleansing, and then this one is kind of hard. It's like for exfoliating. So I'm gonna wash this first because they've just been in my closet. Quickly. Give it a wash before I use it. Guys, tell me what I can use um, for my hairline. I know it's not the wigs because the wigs have actually helped grow it a little bit more because I never like stick the wig on my hair I always stick it like on my skin if you guys always see the installs that I do my hairdresser was actually saying oh your your hairline looks so much better so tell me what I can so it's there but it's like short hair tell me what I can use to make it thick any recommendations would really like be welcome anyways I've quickly given that a wash so we're gonna dampen it and I can't believe these things have been sitting in my closet for like over six months. Let's see how that feels. I always see the the Instagram girlies using these and I was like that's so bougie. But I kind of feel like that's just waste product, if I'm being honest. So I'll do one for... This is the cleanse one. I wonder how I would keep it like clean, like for the long run. I don't know. I don't know. Anyways, guys, why I stopped like with the deco series, like what I was say, what I was saying is because i went through like a depressive relapse where like i just couldn't do anything and that's when i even like made a poll on my instagram and then um people were telling me about how contraception can be a part of why you have depression so i'm looking for another contraceptive method that could help i know people say the what's it called people say that i should try the What's it called? The loop. And people were saying that it's not as, it's not painful to get in. But I'm just like, why is it that we women can only give birth like once a year, but men can impregnate women like, I don't know how many times in the year, but it's us women who have to take contraception. Like, I've actually never understood that. Like, aren't they like um, other contraceptive methods for men so that it kind of like feels like it's equal because we get like i feel like we get the short end of the stick honestly speaking because we like we go through the hormonal things like even like when you're struggling to get pregnant it's like women like like that go through the most i don't know it's like women that go through the most even like with society it's like i remember somebody hey to me that kids are planned by the woman and i was like huh and i'm like yeah it's the woman who decides how many kids y'all gonna have is the woman that decides when she wants to have a kid because she's the one taking the contraception i was like this is actually like so vile but yeah guys um if you have any other recommendations that's not a pill 
please do let me know in the comment section i know this may be tmi for my younger audience or those that don't have kids but a girl your girl needs help your girl needs help but like working out has really been helping me with like my mental health and has been helping me like feel a little bit more alive and i feel like i'm at that stage where i'm just like ah <sighs> fix it jesus fix it jesus i think this is basically it i never feel like i've properly rinsed my face if i don't splash water on it but i feel like at spas this is what they do like they just they just wipe you with this thing and you <laughs> and it's like less of a messy job anyways i'm gonna go ahead and say good night to you guys don't forget to like comment subscribe hit the post notification bell i hope we'll get good rest today because we have a sickling who is my daughter she's yeah today it's not happening she actually had to miss school because that's how bad like she's feeling but anyways thank you guys so much for watching don't forget to like comment subscribe hit the post notification bell so that you notify each and every time i upload a new vlog and i'll see you in my next one guys bye